Today is the early signing period for high school football players and mid-year junior college transfers to sign a national letter of intent to play at either the Division I or Division II level. Well, there were no local high school football players in our area signing today, but SIU, they were very busy. The Saluki signed 18 new athletes, so let's take a look at some of those newest members of the SIU football team. Deontay Cox is the twin brother of Saluki's wide receiver, Avante Cox. He's another offensive weapon transferring in from Missouri Baptist. Jalen DeVries is the only quarterback on the list, a 6'2 freshman who holds multiple passing records in Iowa. In fact, his dad, Jared, was an All-American at Iowa and played 12 seasons for the Detroit Lions. Now, Isaiah Hartrup is one of four wide receivers signed. He was All-State in Missouri, can return kicks as well, gain nearly 2,000 all-purpose yards. Chris Corwitz is 6'4", nearly 300 pounds as an offensive lineman. He helped guide Rochester to three state titles. His dad, Chris, was a center at the University of Illinois. Now let's keep moving on. Aaron Maddox, well, he stands out. One of five defensive backs who signed with SIU this past season. Maddox started three games at the University of Colorado and played in all 12 games for the Buffaloes in 2018 and SIU signed four defensive linemen. Jake Petzl is a high motor player who excelled in basketball and was a junior college honorable, honorable mention All-American. And the last group, Jalon Welch gives SIU more team speed at cornerback. He's been clocked at 4-3 in the 40. Zach Gibson is an athletic tight end, plans on walking on for the SIU basketball team. In fact, he played AAU ball for Brian Mullen's dad, Mike. So there's lots of athletes with this class, but Coach Hill, will any of these signees have a realistic chance of playing right away? Right now with the, the four year, the four game rule, when I sit in their living room and they should all be coming here expecting to play. That's what I told when we do, uh, you know, we have developmental practices every Sunday and my message to them every Sunday night is, especially once you get through training camp and you get through the bye week and you get to week six, seven, we've been going at this thing. You're not a freshman anymore. You should look like a different player. You should be playing better. And so uh, it was fun to see some of those freshmen that got to play on special teams uh, in North Dakota State. You know, they got their third or second game at North Dakota State because they started to develop. They started to practice better. So. Uh, used to you'd be pulling the red shirt for that and they didn't get to do that. So I think it's helped in the development of the kid because they get to they get to come and compete and know that I could get rewarded even if it's late. I'm not ready right now, but I could be and uh, in play. So they should all show up saying I'm going to compete to play. And if you want to get to know the entire SIU signing class, well, we've got you covered. More details on each player available on WSILTV.com.